the Mount Katahdin Scenic Rest Area again. Oh man, it's a good sight. Yeah. It's what the AT people dream of for the end of their 2,000 some mile hike. Relatively quiet. And I've got the whole place to myself. So that's uh, nice. I mean, for a highway, it's very quiet. I'm gonna tell you some freaky spooky ghost stories. What do you think? <laughs> Today's quote. Sometimes when you are in a dark place, you think you have been buried, but actually you have been planted. To become a new, you need to tear down the old and tearing down the old hurts. You know, it's like freaking taking a Brillo pad to your soul. Teething hurts, right? So this is kind of like spiritual teething. The fruit flies are out. And so is Mount Katahdin. Looking very pretty over there. Still got the snow on top. Let's see if I can get a couple of these guys to... Vamos. Yeah, get a move on. There's no free rent here. <laughs> nice. Uh, people kind of stay here for like an average two minutes and look at the mountain, take a picture, and then leave. Let's go to our next subject. Yep, taking the picture. <laughs> <laughs> now, um, how many bugs are out here? But how many are plastering themselves to my windshield? in the reflection of the door. I look like I got shocked by electricity or something. Oh wow. Oh look at that. Got a little cubby all over the door. That's cool. <laughs>
just the idea of you know what you could get um, a pre-made drop on your property for a certain amount of money it looks like there's another one over there I like that these look like log cabins these ones have curved um, curved wood so it's not a log but it looks a lot better I think this one's large yeah you can see um, kind of looks it's very sloped I don't know if this one's for sale How good it feels to be clean, man. <laughs> Patrick's in fine style for sure. <laughs> oh man, the style of clean. Oh, it's been it's been too long. Definitely gonna have to figure out a showering situation up there. Shower, pizza, weekend, camping. What what's left? You know, I got the one with the extra extra pepper. I promised myself a pizza a long time ago, and I don't know how long it's been since I've had a Caesars. <sighs> I, would, I would have to say years. Figure this is a nice spot to eat the pizza. It's looking pretty grim though. Looks like it's about to rain. But we got a nice railroad bridge, river action, and uh, a sort of skyline, I guess. You got a church. It's like a hospital. No, that's a judicial center. Yeah, I'll give you a look uh, afterwards. It's a nice little walk uh, on the side of the river here. Yeah. Further down the way, took a little bit of a walk. Slings back out. Weird. <laughs> Oh, it looks totally ominous, and yet, nothing. shipping container from I just think they're too narrow you know they're decent prices way too narrow I mean eight feet is just too narrow if you put something on one side you're just gonna literally have to almost turn your body sideways to get through every time I, I like a big wide area you know the 20 foot shipping container is the same price as the 12 by 24 mile 12 by 24 mile, turn right is almost two times as big. You know, for the same price. And granted, it is wood, but um, I just like having an extra four feet or even having an extra six feet wide. 
right, we've made it to the destination. Yes, you can hear water rushing and roaring. We're back in the White Mountains. Different spot, though. I, I don't know if this one's better yet. I'm not at a specific campsite. I figure I would go down there during the light and see what's uh, up on offer. You can even see the moon in the sky. I do hope you take care, and I'll see you in the next one. Have that self-care in the forest. Get out there.